Hello fellow technicians. So what I've done here is I've taken a six dollar toolbox from Walmart. I don't know why I didn't think of that sooner. You know, six bucks better cheaper than the battery box and structurally better. Um, and I've taken these little 12 volt batteries that you can you know get at a battery store I got these from battery Mart in martinsburg and i've hooked them up in parallel now in, instead of uh in series to you know require less parts if you have in series but you need to either have like something set up to uh, charge it and uh if you hook them up in parallel you can charge it with any cheap old you know 12 volt charger which is a lot more convenient and it and helps to ensure you've got a nice and even um, charge also so I've taken this uh, boosting module this uh, you know uh, I've kind of rigged it up a little bit but I've got those running in, in uh, parallel going into the input of the module and I have the output of the module just hooked straight to this uh, DC uh, voltmeter because mysteriously it just fit perfectly in there so I'm gonna go with that just you know just for fun now you'll notice that I left two open here that's so I can charge them all right now check this out I put a little switch in there a little illuminated switch because I'm cool like that okay and see the cool thing about this uh, toolbox is isn't that crazy You can just drill holes in it real easy, zip tie stuff, no sweat. So, um, as you can see, I've got it set to around 60 volts DC output. Um, and as long as your parts can handle the current that is uh, required of the battery pack or batteries or whatever you have rigged up, um, you can run your stuff with it. You can run vehicle, like little vehicles, whatever. And uh, that's how you do it. So I hope this was uh, informative and you don't have to spend thousands of dollars on batteries. Man, I threw this crap together right here. Maybe, what, $150, $200, something like that. Just takes a little bit of time, some tools, and knowledge. That's where it's at. Thanks for watching.